What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel for another video. Today we have come over here to Lee Farms Pumpkin Patch here in Tualatin, Oregon. I thought that we had been here before but we haven't. This is actually a new one so we're going to check out and see how this one is this year. So it's a new one for us. We're going to check it out. We're going to get some food, go in the corn maze and do all that stuff. And So come along with us on another vlog. So I want to talk about the admission here to Lee's Farms in Tualatin, Oregon. So the tickets were $15 each person. We bought them online ahead of time. So 60 bucks for all four of us. And then the parking is free. But if you guys want to do some activities like the slide, like some, there, there's some like jumping, like jumping things for the kids, then you do have to pay like 30 bucks for each wristband. I don't know if they sell them individually for every activity, but yeah, the wristband was 30 bucks. We haven't got the kids that yet because we're gonna see, because there is a play area where they can play for free. So we're gonna see how much we do. And if they really, really want to go on there, then we'll probably get them for them. But yeah, $15 for admission for each person, uh, no parking fee. And then you have an option to get a wristband if you want to. But the, the admission comes with a hayride and it comes with a corn maze as well. And then the play area is free. And then we'll obviously walking around and stuff. So they got cornhole you could do right here. bunch of tables where you can come and sit now right here right now it's not crowded because we actually came pretty early it's actually an advice I would always give you guys whatever event that you guys go to whatever theme park whatever event like this always get there as early as you can because people start getting here like three or four hours after they open all right my family's already in line for the tractor I think so let's go check that out over here to the corn maze because right across the street from the pumpkin where you get pumpkins <laughs> I feel like we went all the way to the back of the maze I think the exit is back to where we started or, or next to it. If we went this way, how did we make the exit, guys? Alright, I guess we made it out of the maze. No, Found okay. the exit. It's just on the other side. We started up there. Now this is the exit right here. I think instead of taking the hayride back to the main area, I think we're gonna walk it. And I believe it's this trail right here. They have a trail right here that leads you back there. So I think to be a little adventurous, to be a little outdoorsy, we're gonna go through the trail and walk it instead of getting back on the hayride. Whoa! It is kind of like a big hill down. I'm sorry, but I got to <laughs> speed because if I don't, Alright, we're almost there. It wasn't that bad of a hike. Okay, so here's the tractor trail here, or the path, and I believe we're gonna go straight this way to get back there. Got this house here next to the farm. So there's Sleeve Farms right there. And here's this pretty nice house. I wonder if that's where the owner where lives. We're on the trail, we're almost there.
are right here by the swings. It's kind of, I guess, the play area where it is included with your admission. But right behind me is the bounce pillow, a huge bounce pillow. But that you do have to get a wrist map for. And then there's a, another jumping bed and some other things that you do have to pay for. I'm not sure it's 30 bucks each wristband for just doing the bounce pillow and like the, the other better one so we're kind of we're kind of deciding like should we pay 30 bucks each kid 60 bucks in total for them just doing a bounce pillow and uh, the other thing it's expensive so we're still deciding right now they're just playing right here in the play area This contraption here is like a, a tractor, a big huge tractor, and it's like attached to a slide here for the kids to go down of. <laughs> That's pretty cool. The girls got this apple here. It's all decorated. I think it's like a candy apple. And then it has like marshmallows. That's pretty cool. They got some nice shirts here. Leaf Farms. My wife likes this one. I like that one too. I like the color there. But we just got um, some snacks. We got some fries, some nachos, some drinks from this stand here. We're just waiting for the order. Okay, we got our snacks. We got some fries and some nachos. All right, found our table. Got our fries. Ranch, we had some nachos. What is that, honey? It's a finger. It's a finger. You're so close to me. It's not close, it's wide. Take all, oh, no, it's good. I would assume that. I would assume that the candy's like bland. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, look, oh, those are teeth. <laughs> <laughs> you want the apple? Can you guys take it off because I can't? I want the candy right here. There's a gummy bat. I'm gonna eat that. Or do you want it? Ah! <laughs> Good pumpkin donuts. They make them fresh here at Lee Farms. Right before we leave, we're checking out this uh, gift shop in here. We have a couple things here. Got some flowers, or roses. Some, of course, some clothing, pillows. Look at that. The Hocus Pocus. Hocus Pocus seems to be everywhere during Halloween. <laughs> Yikes. I love this. What does that say? There's a little witch in all of us. <laughs> Some candies. Lollipops. Got groceries and dry goods here. <laughs> Look at these. Okay, so I think it's gonna conclude our time here at Lee Farms in Tualatin, Oregon. We got here around 11 and it's about to be two o'clock, so about three hours. Um, pretty nice pumpkin patch, it's the first time here. Like I said at the beginning of the video, I thought it was gonna be one that we went to like three or four years ago, but it was a completely different one, which we don't mind because you know it was, an, it was a nice experience, experiencing something different. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, do me a favor, hit the thumbs up button. Consider subscribing if you haven't subscribed yet, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.